The top three most purchased over-under shotguns in the U.S. Shotguns have been a staple in American firearms culture for centuries, serving a wide range of purposes from hunting to home defense. Among the various shotgun types, over-under shotguns have gained significant popularity in recent years. Known for their versatility, accuracy, and aesthetic appeal, over-under shotguns are a favorite among shooting enthusiasts. Let's take a look at the best of the guns in the U.S. Number 3. CZ USA Drake. Price, $800. The CZ Drake brought the shotgun in an excellent hard case with the CZ Shooting Sports logo, which features a flying rooster. When you open the case, you'll find a three-piece, visually appealing over-under shotgun crafted from Turkish walnut. A choke tool and a small case of choke tubes also had their own dedicated storage space. Five available choke tubes can be switched out immediately. One of the first things a viewer of the firearm would notice is the inscription, Hoglu made in Turkey. After doing some online digging, I discovered that CZ has been bringing Hoglu CZ branded shotguns into the country since at least 2005. Shotguns made in Turkey are well known for their quality and affordability. It was recently discovered that Hoglu has been producing shotguns since 1914 and even has its series of scatter guns. Another significant bonus is that CZ still includes a five year warranty on all all Hooglu manufactured CZ USA firearms. Everything pointed to the fact that this was a high quality import from Turkey. This stylish shotgun seemed like it had seen very little use beyond the superficial scratches. Anyone seeing this would feel encouraged to use it in a shooting session right away. The pistol grip and foregrip are both fitted with laser engraved checkering, which is neither unduly aggressive nor too subtle to perform the job. In addition, the receiver features some tasteful laser engraved scroll markings, which, while not flashy or visually arresting are a welcome addition to an otherwise empty area. The 8mm flat vented rib is quite effective at cutting down on reflections. A large, white, polymer front sight sits atop the barrels. Shell extractors let shooters reload their magazines fast. A conventional tang safety, complete with a selector switch and a lever to break open the action, can be found on the rear of the receiver. At first, everything appeared to be a little stiff, which was another reason why this appeared to be either a factory damaged or refurbished model or a shotgun that someone had simply purchased but had rarely fired. A buttstock pad with a simple design that didn't appear to be very forgiving but still offered sufficient cushioning to get the job done. In either case, everyone would be eager to get their hands on it and try it out on the range. The model that was purchased is a 12 gauge. However, other options in the Drake portfolio include .410 bore, 20 gauge, and 28 gauge models respectively. For all the left-handed shooters out there, it is also offered in 12 and 20 gauge Southpaw variants to choose from. Number 2. Beretta Model 686. Price, $2,600. The Beretta 686 Silver Pigeon 1 stands out because of its high-quality construction, longevity, and manageability. As is typical for Beretta, even their entry-level shotgun is quite well-equipped. But consider this. After starting at less than $3,000, the next rung up the Italian manufacturer's ladder costs more than $4,000. Because it shares the same quality, engineering, and technology as the base for higher-spec Berettas, the Silver Pigeon 1 offers exceptional value in this regard. The field model is designed specifically for hunting, while the sporting variant can be used for a variety of purposes. There are quite a few distinctions, but they are all minor nuances. The ejectors on the sporting model are convenient for speedy reloading, but annoying if you don't want to leave trash lying around in the woods. The field model's safety mechanism is always on, whereas the sporting model can be manually activated. Both have a safety that doubles as a choose trigger, allowing you to choose which barrel goes off first. This model's front end is broader than the field's, while while the default is a schnabel tip, a flush finished forend is an option. All variants come standard with 30 inch barrels. The field model is limited to 28 inch barrels. Ribs are allowed to breathe here. For an additional fee, the sporting can be outfitted with an adjustable comb. Having it would be beneficial as well. Getting back to the fundamentals, due to recent improvements, the 686 now comes with a set of barrels that are both lightweight and durable. The 30-inch barrels of this firearm weigh only 1,426 grams with the chokes installed. The barrels of Beretta's firearms are made from tri-alloy steel that has been drilled, cold hammer forged, and vacuum relieved. Steelium is the name given to this alloy, which boasts unprovable claims of enhanced ballistic performance. What it appears to do is make Beretta's barrels the lightest in their category, and it's still robust enough to pass proofreading. The gun's light barrels make it manageable to swing around. 
This complements the sleek design of the Beretta, Beretta's low-profile action, in which the locking mechanism is located between the two barrels rather than on top, contributes to the pistol's diminutive size. Most firearms, except the 686, have a hefty appearance and feel. Is the Beretta now superior because of this? Unless it better suits your needs? No. The ultimate test of a shotgun is how well it fits the user, and this varies from person to person. Despite the low-profile action, several shooters have complained that the stock's 32mm drop at the comb and 50mm drop at the heel force their eye to rest too far behind the sighting rib. Weightier barrels are another distinguishing feature of this firearm, as some shooters like them for aiming. The 686, however, strikes an exceptionally pleasing balance. The balancing point of this shotgun is located directly under the hinge. Physically, it feels like it flows with you as you fire. The Beretta is a little lighter than the average gun, so it won't hurt your shoulder after a day of shooting clays. The recoil cushion is very flexible, and because of how well it fits, it does a decent job of masking recoil with a total weight of just over 3.5 kilograms. This pistol isn't exactly featherweight. And, as expected with a Beretta, the whole thing functioned perfectly. There must be some value in a craft that has been around for over half a millennium. One of how Beretta guarantees the Silver Pigeon's durability is through the use of conical locking lugs. Both the wearable parts and the barrel pivot points are easily interchangeable. Beretta's marketing materials make a vague reference to the Silver Pigeon being able to fire over 10,000 rounds without deterioration, but you can safely anticipate it to last a lot longer than that. The 686 Silver Pigeon 1 is a great investment, a point that keeps coming up. It functions flawlessly, is pleasant to hold, and responsive to commands, and is built to last for many years. It also has a nice aesthetic. Number 1. Browning Satori. Price? $2,180. Browning Satori's Feather Lightning 20 gauge features an intricately etched silver nitride receiver and self ejecting shells. The grade 3 4 oil finished walnut stock and vividly blued steel barrels complement the silver nitride treatment applied to the trigger guard. These firearms include an ivory front bead, a black Midas mid bead, and an IC, M, and F extended black Midas choke. Browning's lightweight aluminum frame Satori's are easily recognizable by the Feather logo stamped into the bottom of the receiver. Many of the over 2 million Satori shotguns that have been manufactured over the previous five decades have been outfitted with the Lightning stock, as suggested by the name. The pistol handle has a rounded knob, there is 18 LPI checkering, and the forend is rounded for comfort in the hand. The drop from the comb to the heel is 2.5 inches, and the total length of the pull is 14.25 inches. The lightweight upland hunting gun, the Satori, has recently benefited from the inclusion of an inflex recoil pad, making models like the Feather Lightning more comfortable to shoot with. Satori shotguns are known for their high quality due to their hand-fit parts. The Satori is regarded as a benchmark in the shotgun industry, in part because Moroku has a long history of producing high-quality firearms. If you want to save money by purchasing a stack barrel rather than a Satori, you may have to look past imperfections in the fit and finish, the quality of the parts, and other such things. The Feather Lightning is just another fire firearm that owners shouldn't be frightened to examine thoroughly. However, the Satori gives up very little to expensive firearms. You can find shotguns with fancier wood and side plates, but the Satori can hold its own in the field or at the range next to more expensive firearms. The Satori Feather Lightning 20 gauge has a manufacturer's suggested retail price, or MSRP, of $2,180 and is therefore not cheap. Instead, you can save a lot of money by purchasing one of these firearms, and then you'll have a hunting weapon that will last you and your kids forever. That's all for the video today. We will be right back with more. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.